All right, here I am again, and this is part five, I believe. Uh, all right, we're going to pick up where we left off literally two seconds ago, chapter 11. All the courage in the world cannot prevail against gunfire. August 22nd, 1914, Rosagino, France. Voyez photo, Belgium has slowed the German advance. It's at great cost. Now is our turn. There are seven armies in the invasion force. We have six. It feel better if we had one more army. Where are those English bootlegs? Yes, where are they? Faster, faster! We must gain as much ground as possible. To Paris! Sir, the French are being spotted. Dig in, prepare for artillery. Dig in, what if they charge? We want them to charge. Prepare to charge. But sir, the artillery. We charge, we don't crawl. We are roosters, not worms. Charge! Charge! <laughs> Pretty horrific depiction there, yet at the same time, accurate. Them just getting blown to pieces by shells. Come on, load up. Oh my gosh, why won't the light come back into the screen again? Poor fools. Charging like Napoleon's own army. It's the 20th century and they still wear red pantaloons. Oh, here we go. We got the fight back again. Brave men. It takes courage to charge the enemy head on. These tactics cost the French 200,000 soldiers in the first month of the war. Keep firing! If we can't beat the French... The Russians will steamroll us. Show no mercy. Chapter 12. The Battle of Bonds. Finally, some British action. August 23rd, 1914. Mons, Belgium. Or Mons. Take up positions along this canal. We'll give the Germans a good surprise. Do they even know we're here? They should. It was in the paper yesterday. Here they come! Make your shots count! We're outnumbered three to one! Ike Way! Lieutenant Dace was shot five times, but his machine gun kept firing! Who's holding the second bridge now? Private Godley by himself! Ay, oh, there's a swimmer! A German swimmer! Don't waste shots. What can one swimmer do? He's donning the swing bridge. Shoot him. Shoot him. Waste your bullets. Private Godley, fall back. I'll go last. You go. Go. What's he doing? He's breaking down his machine gun. Come on, Godley. No time for that. You may capture me, but you won't get this machine gun. Blow the bridges! We're nearly overrun! The charges must be con must not be connected. I'm Captain Wright of the Royal Engineers. I'll go plug them in. Are you crazy, sir? We can't let them cross. I'll do the other one. <laughs> Good show. How's Captain Wright doing? He's wounded, sir. Shot. Where is he? With the medic? No, sir, he went back out. Must blow it up, must blow it up. Captain Wright, are you all right? I will be when we blow this blasted bridge. Forget the bridges. The Germans are building their own pontoon bridges. Sir, the French 5th Army is retreating. What? We can hold this position. 
that a Vlanzerax bit the army isn't good in your flank. We'll be sitting ducks. Curse General Lazarak. We need to retreat. Pull back. But the bridge, leave it. Why isn't the Fifth Army holding the ground? They weren't positioned as well as the BEF. The beef? The BEF. It stands for British Expedition. Ex mm. Expeditionary Force. 1,600 BEF soldiers died at Mons. Over 5,000 German soldiers were killed. That's like big numbers. I can't believe we're giving ground. It's a tactical retreat, lads. Don't make it easy for them. We're unstoppable. And we're to Paris! Chapter 13 The Steamroller August 23rd, 1914, Eastern Front, Germany. Save your bullets when things get serious. Isn't this. this isn't serious? But how will we attack? Bayonets! Our supply lines. Oh my gosh, I need to get my Russian accent. Hold on. Okay, I got my Russian accent. They're running. The Germans are running. See, the bayonet works. And you don't even have to reload it. The Russians are crashing us. We need more troops. Here, here comes the car. Maybe they have news about backup. Any news of reinforcements? Yes, these are them. Generals Hindenburg and Ludendorff. Two men? Our reinforcements are two men? Hello, good morning. Hey, it's the guy who knocked on that door. Two men? Is this a joke? We're doomed. They can't send troops. Everyone is needed for the attack on Paris. Hindenburg came out of retirement to join this battle. That fills me with confidence. And Ludendorff took care of the forts at Legis with ease. That was against Belgium's, Belgium's chocolate army. This is against, against the Russian steamroller. Yeah, we're doomed. General Ludendorff, sir, Hoffman's signal car just intercepted this. Good heavens! It's the entire Russian battle plan. Is this real? All of tomorrow's maneuvers are here. They are low on ammo and supply lines are stretched too thin. This is everything. Where did this come from? The Russians are sending their telegrams out over their wireless uncoated. Uncoated? Did they make any effort at security? They sent the telegram right at night. I suppose they thought we were all asleep. We are at number here, but the Russians have shown us their weakness. It's technology. We have secret communications. They don't. We have high-speed railway troop transport. They don't. We'll always be one step ahead of them. We'll encircle them and wipe them off the map. August 1914, the Battle in of Tannenberg. Look, German cavalry, move out! I'm starving, I haven't eaten in three days. No, the Germans are over here! They're moving fast, I'm glad they don't have artillery. That's artillery! We are surrounded. Keep firing. Firing. With what? I'm out of bullets. We have done it. We have encircled the Russians. Annihilate them. Retreat back across the border. The Russians invader, Russian invaders were defeated at Tannenberg. 
80,000 Russian soldiers keeps firing were, were killed. 100,000 were captured. I'm sorry if I'm not getting enough of a authentic Russian accent. I'm going between German and Russian. That is very hard to do. Germany won the battle with 12,000 casualties. We outsmarted a vastly superior force for a smashing victory. Word from the Western Front. They are finally sending reinforcements at last. Oh sure, now they send them. Chapter 14. Hey guys, that was barely 20 minutes for two videos. Like, subscribe, well, like if you've been enjoying this video or in this series. Comment what you want to see next after the series. You don't really have much of a choice because no one comments. Subscribe um, to help support me and my channel. And turn on notifications so you're updated about new videos such as this one. And check out all my other videos such as these two. Bye.